In this video, I want to show you the visualization of ETHOS. In the first video, I showed you how easy it is to connect to ETHOS for the first time. So now, let's take a close look at our visualization. Our visualization runs on an HTML5 application. So it is a web visualization. You don't need any extra software for it. And as you will see, it runs smooth on every common browser that's on the market. Now, I want to show you today how easy and intuitive our visualization is. So the first time you connect to ETHOS, you will typically see the home screen. So that is our landing page. And the home screen, it consists of four main parts. So the first one is the functional section, the functional view in the center of the screen. Right now you can see on my screen here, it's a pictogram of the transformer uh, from one of my training units here. We can see all kinds of interesting values at a glance. We can see alarm statuses, temperatures, uh, power meters, etc., etc. Everything is there easily. And if ever anything goes wrong, we can see it here very easily and uh, in no time. On the top section, we have the main navigation bar. The main navigation bar has two functions. On the home screen, uh, it holds, for example, the communication settings. So if I click on communication, you can see all the settings for the IP addresses, for SCADA communication, and so on. Um, whenever I go deeper in any of the submenus for information or parameterization, you will see it is like a tree structure on top. So it shows you easily where you are and how to get back to where you were before. Then on the right side, we have the main menu bar and that remains there all the time because it's like a steady tree there. It's always available. So if I click on information, you see highlighted, I'm in information or to settings to look at the parameters. Um, so this doesn't disappear at any time. And then at the lower section, we have the administrative bar and the administrative bar um, holds some very nice uh, features. So first of all, on the very left, there is the language selection. Then we can change the currently active user. So the unit has a full user rights management. I want to show that to you in a different video. And uh, then we can reboot the unit. The color can be either black or red. The red says, hey, you still have to do a reboot for certain parameters to take effect. Um, then I can see which user is currently signed in. Then I have date and time. And then there is a little special thing there, the, the tiny MR logo on the bottom there. If you click that from your browser, the unit will open up a manual for that unit from that unit. So there is no internet connection necessary for that. That's offline available on the unit you're currently connected to. So to sum it up, the visualization web-based, so it runs on any typical browser, easy and intuitive with the four main sections. So um, perfect time to simply explore the visualization. Thank you very much for watching and see you soon in the next video.